Top it, top it. Let's go. Top, top. Top your steps. There we go. Show. Very good. Show. Show. Very good. Let's go. Get low, get low. Bring it in, bring it in. All right, y'all. We got state in four weeks. We're going to have a lot of more serious practice. I need y'all to get together. Erica, Cassidy, I need y'all to join the team. Other than that, y'all be ready for practice tomorrow. Bring it in. On three, defense. One, two, three, defense. Hey. Let's have a good night. All right, coach. All right. Oh. Coach Leary. All right, how you doing? I just wanted to introduce you to my Victoria. She just moved here about a month ago. Okay. I'm Coach Leary. Welcome to Duval. Yeah, it's a pleasure, Coach Erica. She has a lot of time. Yeah, thank you. She's definitely a hair for. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> here, baby, take the keys and go start the car for me, okay? You got me a Gatorade? You know I got you a Gatorade. <laughs> right, what's up? Um, yeah, Coach, so... First, I want to say you've been doing a fantastic job with coaching the girls. Um, but can you do a favor for me, please? Um, Erica's really having a tough time at home. Um, her mom passed away a few weeks ago. Really? I didn't know that. Like, she don't show no emotion. Wow. Yeah, I mean, the whole family's kind of taking it tough. Anything I can do, just hit me up. Okay, I will. All right, it was nice to meet you, Miss. Victoria. All right, Miss Victoria. Thank you. How many times I gotta tell you don't scare me like that? Scare you like that? How many times I gotta tell you to change the spare key hiding spot? You don't know me. Don't know you? No, you don't. After 15 years, I think I know you by now. And plus, I'm in here. Well, good. At least somebody know in case something happens to me. Mm. Yeah. What's up? God forbid. Hey, but tell me how the game go, Coach Lee. It's all right. We got a pretty good team this year. <laughs> That's what's up. How mom dukes? Don't ask me about that lady. Please. Come on now. She around here begging me for grandkids and shit. Something that ain't never gonna happen. What's wrong with having a look? Lyric Jr. Oh, uh, what? Never say never. No, sir. I'm not having any kids. I am never having any kids. Yeah, I'm your best friend. Yeah. 
I mean, who size you want? Mine and hers. Best friend? Yeah. Yeah, I guess. Yeah, I guess. Well. What you about to do? I'm going to slide see my girlfriend. After that, I don't know. I'm going to see you tomorrow, though. You trying to hoop? Yeah, I'll jump now. I ain't got nothing else to do. If you think you lonely now. Hey, next time not before you get popped. All right. You see yourself in, you can see yourself out. Coach Lyric, what you doing? Oh, hey, Miss Richardson. I'm just watching one of my players. Where are you headed to? Just the break room. Speaking of your basketball players, you've done such a good job. How did you do it? Easy. I love basketball. I think we got a real good shot at state this year. I know y'all got that for show. In the bag. Come on, Tell me about it. It's crazy how people think they can catch homosexuality. Just keep it in your sweet self. So sweet, Miss Richardson. You know, they need to be more like you. Everybody can't be me. <laughs> that is right. <laughs> hey, that was good. Clap once on the miss, twice on the make. I'm tired of hitting the baseline. Cause when y'all two flirty and motherfuckers, no wonder the whole school think we lesbians. Yeah. Man, speak for yourself. But y'all, y'all save that for off the court. Man, you need to worry about yourself. You worry about championship. Ooh. Lucky, lucky, lucky. Hey, Erica, what you still doing here? It's after dark. I called my auntie, but she ain't picking up. Picking up when the last time you called her? Just a few minutes ago. Oh. Well, come on, I'll take you to the house. You know how to get there? So, Coach Lee, why do you wear boy clothes? Because it's comfortable. Why you wear weave? Because I ain't got no edges. <laughs> True. Coach. Yeah. Do you like my auntie? Man, get your mouth off that, Erica. Yeah. I'm so sorry. Oh my God. I am I am so so sorry. I oh, I'm yeah. still trying to get in the pattern of everything. I I really apologize. No, no need for apologies. Okay. I really wasn't doing anything anyway. Oh. I got him. Thank you. You good? Uh yeah, yeah, I'm okay. I'm fine. Sure? Yeah, yeah, I'm alright. Alright, all right, well, I'm here if you need me. Okay. Good night, Thank you. Good night. You, you. Why that dyke was coming up out of my house? You like women now? That's just Erica's coat. She just dropped her off. <laughs> you some type of soccer mom now, huh? Bitch wouldn't even give me no kids. 
I wonder why. Why you trash as fuck? Shit, you still trash, man. Oh, yeah, I don't need no motherfucking help, huh? Hey, look. I'm just as serious as you might be. Hey, excuse me for having good sportsmanship. The girls got practice later. So I'm gonna be with them. When you gonna get to one girl and just settle down? <laughs> settle down. Whenever you go straight. Shit, I guess that'll be never. <laughs> one of these days, your dick gonna fall off, you know that? Hey, and if that day come, I'm gonna be dead. That's gonna be tomorrow. <laughs> That's gonna be off time. Alright. You talking about me? Where well, you gonna find somebody and settle down? Your guess just as good as mine. I'm picky as hell. But I damn sure need my motherfucking mama to stop harassing me about some grandchildren she ain't never gonna see. Yeah, that's true. Hey, why not have a little lick? Like, no, it just ain't for me. It really ain't. I just know. You yeah, know, But I do got this one player. Her auntie. Whoa. She's fine as fuck. Shit. What you say to her? Nothing, man. I think she got a boyfriend. What you? How about I told you anything? Back door season. Oh boy, wow. You gotta got get you some game off the court. And as well on the court too. Man, well, yeah. <laughs> Let's go! Oh, what's this for? Coach's knee get raised too. That was a hard ass practice. I just want to apologize to you about the other day. Oh, no need to apologize. I really meant it. Well, I'm about to say Erica is some of the other girls at CC's Pizza. Did you want to join? Yeah, we can do that. Yeah. Let's okay. go. Okay, perfect. All right, thank you. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Good, ready for state. Uh, I got you. Can play state play? I don't want this. You want to go to the arcade and play games? Yeah, I'll be back. My time to peace, man. Yeah. 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 About to bust this down. What you like to do other than coach? Uh, I like to shoot pool. Yeah, I'm pretty good at it. <laughs> okay, I'll play a game with two. We should go play one day. Girl, I hate to have to do you like that on that table. <laughs> you don't see me? <laughs> no, I don't see you beat me. <laughs> we gonna have to see. Anytime, whenever you ready. Shit, I got a serious stick game. You gotta show me. Oh, shit, we can set something up. Okay, let's do that. Oh, oh what a way that. <laughs> Stop cheating. As we leave here today, I just want each of you to remember that in your time of need, always hold on to God's unchanging hand. Let the church stand and bow your heads in prayer. Thank you for this most gracious and precious day. We thank you for bringing us all here this morning to worship you in God's holy name. Father, we thank you for releasing angels to encamp about us as we're traveling back to our destinations, Father God. Father God, we thank you for this most precious and gracious day. Thank you for waking us up this morning and for guiding us here today. Lord, we pray that you release angels to encamp about us and protect us, clothing us in our right minds. Father God, we thank you.
Dang, church was long today. Mm -hmm. What happened to you coming back in? Oh, my stomach started hurting so bad, Mom. You got to come better than that. Well, why pass around? So I always got to talk about gay people when I come in there. He does not. He does, too. He does not. He does, too. I mean, is he wrong, though? It does say we're supposed to be fruitful and multiply. I mean, how am I supposed to ever have any grandbabies when you're around here bumping coochies? I don't even want kids. There, I love you. But, I mean, you're grown now and you got your own stuff going on and I'm lonely out here. Oh, I never said I wouldn't adopt later on. Can we get something to eat now? Yes, we can, baby. Oh, thank you. What's up, Lyric? What you doing? Oh, hey, Ms. Rissen. Nothing. Going over some of the girls' stats. So I'm guessing you haven't heard. Heard about what? About the don't ask, don't tell policy. Don't ask, don't tell. Principal Faggot issued this? You know she did. You know what? This is getting out of hand. I'll meet you in your office. I got to have a talk with Principal Faggot. Excuse me. Yeah, excuse you with your dyke ass. Not going on somewhere. Excuse me, but what did I just hear you say to her? Nothing. You, well, I better not hear you talk like that to nobody else. Now get your butt to class. You all right, Erica? Yes. You need to be in class too. Now get the. Yes. Principal Faggot, can I have a word with you real quick? Come on, Coach Lyric. Is there a reason you have this don't ask, don't tell policy put into play? School world feels like that doesn't belong in the school. Or I don't belong in the school place. In the school. I did not say that. You don't have to. I see the teachers talking about me and laughing behind my back. I didn't say you weren't a good teacher. We just feel like that does not belong in the school place. It won't be tolerated. I don't even talk about my sexuality. This is a school for Christ's sakes. I come here and I do my job. Okay, Coach Lyric, as long as you come here and do your job, you should be okay. Oh, swear to God. How did it go? Man, these speedway is impossible sometimes. Girl, I'm trying to be here for 10 years. I mean, at this point, I'm ready to put the whole school board, these teachers, and these children in the choke. Okay, Aunt Tranchable. I'm serious. But don't even let them get to you. At the end of the day, you always gonna be my dog. You know, I got thick skin. Well, that shit aggravating. Mm -hmm. Well, I appreciate it, though. Of course. What you got going on, little? Girl, I'm finna go home, make me some food, probably watch me some Lifetime. You know the vibes. Lifetime, Macalena. Girl. Boring. Anyway, I'm going out to the pool hall later on. If you want to join, bring a couple friends. You know you more than welcome. I appreciate it, but I'm a pass. You know, FCAT's coming up, so I gotta spend this extra time making these assignments for these needy kids. Mm. No plan too hard. <laughs> Not for this school. But I hope your your girlfriend ain't no booger wolf like. Dog, you here to make sure shit smooth and unawkward, dog. Chill. All right, I'm smooth and unawkward. I got you. Thank you, thank you. So just do me a favor. Stop worrying about yourself. Worry about myself? I wouldn't yeah. even ask you to came if I worry about myself. Hey, look out, now. Hey, but for real, you gonna get no drawers tonight? No, no, no. I'm not what fucking that girl tonight. No, I'm not fucking that girl tonight. Why not? Stop being a pussy. Take this shit. What the fuck this is? Hey, you already know. What the fuck I'm supposed to put this on, might be? Hey, hell if I know. Shit, what that shit called? The strap. Why? Hey, why? Oh, they got the girls right there. Hey, how you doing? Hey, everybody here to catch that air, huh? Good. Oh, hey. I'm sorry. This might be, might be right, this nice Victoria. Nice so, look, <clears> let's make things. <clears> this is Courtney. Listen, let's make these things interesting. Word. Loser, so gotta take a shot and chug a beer. I'm down. What? That's nothing. Who getting drunk first? 
you. Let me go back to yesterday. Let's finish what we started. They were. I drill it to the ball. I want you down low. I want you to play me straight up, all right? Get low. Let me see. Get low. Ready? Come on, stay on me. Good. Good. Good, good. Let's do it again. Come on. Let's go. Drive in. Good, good. All right, post. I want you to do some post moves. I want you be calling for the ball. Be, be calling for the ball. All right, call for the ball. All right, drop step. No. So you when you drop, you want to drop this pivot foot. Drop it back, and then up towards the, towards the rectangle. So yeah, I'm finna drop it back with you. Drop back. Oh, there you go, boom. So it's gonna look like this. Oh. Okay. Down. Call for the ball. That's a good practice, Erica. I want you to work on your drop step, okay? We got state coming up. All right, you can go dress out. Hey, Victoria. Hey. <laughs> right. I'm, I'm doing good. You know, you do so good with these kids. Like, how do you do it? It's easy. Dedication is key. But Erica's just as committed as me, so that make it even easier. You know, this is her senior year. A lot of colleges are going to be looking at her. I know. Like, I don't even know how I'm supposed to handle all this. Like, one day I'm free. I'm living my best life. No kids. And then, boom, I got a kid. Like, how am I supposed to even handle what's cutting me? I'm a firm believer in everything happened for a reason, you know what I'm saying? But in the meantime, you got me to help. Oh, really? Really? <laughs> hey, you enjoyed it last night? I did, did you? I did. I know you would. You know. What are y'all doing? I saw y'all kissing. No, we weren't. Yes, you were to my office right now, both of you. Now, now. Hello? Yes, ma'am. All right, Principal Fagger. We'll be there shortly. Hey, your damn niece in some type of trouble at that school. Oh my God, is she okay? 
Yeah, but she's saying we gotta come up there. Look, this not about to be an ongoing thing in this house. Debbie Ray, just come on. You don't even know what's going on. Come on. Well, Ms. Bishop, we're going to suspend Cassidy for three days. Oh, well, quite frankly, I think that's a bit much. It's a school policy. Well, I appreciate you calling me. You, I'll do what you want to get home. Get your ass to the car. Got me missing work and shit. Erica, Miss Victoria, can you step in my office now, please? So what's all this even about? We call Erica and the young lady that just walked out doing homosexual activities today. <laughs> I knew that diet culture rub off on me. That's, that's not necessary. Erica, is this true? It is. I want some type of action taken. All right, just chill. I will not chill. Coach Lyric to the principal's office. Coach Lyric to the principal's office. Yeah, come in, Coach Larry. You wanted to see me? Today, Erica and another young lady were caught doing homosexual activities in the stairwell. Okay, what's it got to do with me? She said she learned it from me. What? Is this true, Erica? Erica, is this true? Victoria, you know I you know. I no, as of this moment, you are suspended. What is that really necessary? That's policy, man. Why are you taking up for this dike? Don't, don't do that, sir. Nah, we out. <clears throat> come on. Hey, come on. I said, come on, man. Let's go. Hey, stay away from my family, man. All right, playboy. Yeah, all right. Hey, what is your problem with me? I don't have a problem with you, Coach Lyric. You know we have a policy, and you have broke that policy. Who gonna take the girls to state now? I guess the assistant coach. As of right now, you're suspended. You have 15 minutes to pack your stuff up, and security will escort you to your car. Security? I don't need no damn security. All right, Coach Lyric. Coach Larry, I heard. Dang, news travel fast. Miss Richardson, you know I would never. You already know I know. But you can't let them get away with this. I mean, you know I'm gonna be behind you the whole way. Mm -hmm. Principal Faggot really is a character, though. She, she got a vendetta on me. I don't know why. Hey, Coach Larry, Principal Faggot need me to escort you off the premises. I told that lady I ain't need no security. Hey, I'm just doing my job. Erica, go to your room. I'm gonna deal with your ass later. Yes, ma'am. And don't think about coming out either. Really? It's all right even call for it? That's my niece. I can handle her. Yeah, but this is my house, and I ain't raising no damn dyke either. I don't want to see that coach nowhere near around here again. Do you understand? Just overreacting. <laughs> I said, do you understand? In news today, we have a teacher by the name of Lyric Johnson that has been suspended due to the don't ask, don't tell policy that the school board has implemented just a few days ago. We'll have more updates on this story later on tonight. Tune in.
Hey, Lyric, it's mom. I seen what happened on the news. Give me a call back when you get this, please. I'm worried about you, baby. This has been plastered all over the news. What I'm gonna do? I'm so sorry. I'm sorry. What you think about? Thinking about what I'm gonna do next. Hmm. How much you come to the house? Coach Erica, get her ready for scouts. Mm. I don't know. Yeah, dude, he big as fuck. I ain't have to do him like that, man. <laughs> he work every day until seven. You sure about that, man? Why not? Don't nobody know Erica like you do. You need it. You know? I guess we can start from now. I, I can okay. come over tomorrow. Okay. When I see you tomorrow. <laughs> Teachers have lives too! I suspend Lyric Johnson. I suspend Lyric Johnson. Teachers have lives too. Teachers have lives too. I suspend Lyric Johnson. I suspend Lyric Johnson. Teachers have lives too. Teachers have lives too. I suspend Lyric Johnson. I suspend Lyric Johnson. Teachers have lives too. Teachers have lives too. I suspend Lyric Johnson. I suspend Lyric Johnson. Teachers have lives too. Teachers have lives too. I suspend Lyric Johnson. I suspend Lyric Johnson. Teachers have lives too. I suspend Lyric Johnson. Teachers have lives too. What are you doing, Coach Johnson? I'm fighting the injustice. Is there something wrong with our peaceful protest? It's not going to do you any good. Coach Johnson, you are suspended from the school premises. I need for you to disperse. I need for y'all to leave the school premises. I suspend Lyric Johnson. Teachers have lives too. I suspend Larry Johnson. 
All right, right now we about to do a couple passes. I want you to step into them, all right? Chest pass. Right here. Good. Mouse pass. Step into it. Good. Overhead. Step into it. Good. Front to side. Good. All right, take your 10 minute break. Thank you. Thank you for helping cut your hair, I appreciate it. Hey, that's no problem. Damn. Well, all right, Erica. I'll see you later. Okay. I tell y'all I ain't want you on my property again. Hey, man, go on. Huh. Come on. Hey, where you think you going that evening? Hey, get your motherfucking hands off of me. <laughs> oh, you want to be a man, huh? Hey, what's so up? So I'm going to treat you like one. Uh, hey, what the fuck are you doing? Hey, get off my property now. Man, what the fuck wrong with you? You're going to regret putting your motherfucking hands on me. <laughs> Make sure you bring a man next time. Ray, stop all of that! Ray, what you even do all of that for? Didn't I tell y'all I ain't want that dyke around my house? Huh? You support that kind of behavior, huh? You right. like that bitch? You gonna leave me for a woman now? I'm gonna leave you for you! Get out of my face! You gonna leave me for a dyke? Huh? 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 Pushed me to the ground, I got up and pushed him back. Then he put him on fucking hand around my throat and pushed me back again. I'm repeating, man. See, look, that's why I've been telling you when you were alone. What the fuck are you doing? Look, I just thought. What you, what you thought, man? Because I got hit, I wanted some dick? No, it's nothing like that. Nothing like that? You supposed to be my best friend. I apologize. You just like the rest of these niggas. You only got one thing on your mind. Come on, Larry. It's nothing like that. I apologize. I promise you. Oh, hold on. Hello? Oh my gosh, she all right? Yeah. I'm on my way. Can I help? Let me help. What? Help make another pass at me? No, that's a like that. Here. You think everything okay with your auntie? I hope so. I called you as soon as it happened. Dang, that's crazy. All right. So, why did you lie on Coach Lyric about the situation? I don't know. I was scared of Ray and what people might say. You're going to have to tell the truth. Coach could lose her job. I'm scared. You don't got to be scared. Everything going to be okay. I'm here. I got here as fast as I could. Yes, Girls, y'all okay? Yes, ma'am. <sighs> Girls, dinner's ready. Go in the kitchen and fix you something. Maybe, okay? Thank you so much, Miss Bishop. It's no problem at all. I called you as soon as Erica called Cassidy. So how's he doing? He's pretty bruised up, but she'll be okay. You know, she's in there in the room cleaning out composure right now. I uh, appreciate that. I'm sure it should take her long. Yeah, time. I know she's going through a lot, but you know, the girl Erica, they can stay here until she get everything together. You know, if I go have a couple of words. Go ahead. Right. Thank you. And as for me, I think I'm gonna live. I just feel like this is all my fault. A bit left, right? Besides, this wasn't my first walk in the park with a woman. I wasn't your first woman? <laughs> yeah, I mean, back in my younger years, it's, it's been a minute though. I know you did the thing too good. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> what about you? You won't be okay? I don't know. I got this boy at my meeting tomorrow. I don't know what's gonna happen. It's tough, but I ain't the same though. I ain't. And you shouldn't be. Larry Johnson, you're an amazing woman. So this is what you're gonna do. You're gonna walk into that auditorium tomorrow with your head held high. And just know that life don't make no mistakes. Okay. You know what? I think I can do that. No, you can't. I just want you to get some rest and I'll take on you later, alright? Okay.
okay in the new policies of the don't ask, don't tell code. We seem to be having a problem here at uh, Kiva High School. Is that correct? Yes, ma'am. Okay. Uh, Principal Faggart, step forward, please. Okay. Now, Principal Faggart, it's good to see you again. Now, what seems to be the problem? The other day we caught two young ladies having inappropriate behavior in the stairwell. And when questioned about it, they said that they learned the behavior from Coach Rick Johnson. Now, you know I read up on this incident. Yes, ma'am. Coach Johnson, could you please step forward? Yes, Ms. Washington. Coach Johnson, are these allegations true? No, ma'am. They couldn't be any more false. Well, why would these young ladies say this? I don't know. I, I'm not the most feminine of women. Well, is it true that you're a part of the LGBT community? I just don't say why that matters, Miss Washington. Yeah, I guess you can label me as a lesbian. Look, I haven't done anything wrong. This is all out of pocket. Excuse me, excuse me. Um. My niece has something to say. Yes, Lee? We didn't get our extras from Coach Johnson. <gasps> Cassie, what are you doing? But, Mom, I'm sorry. Me and Erica been close you friends. You know what? I done had enough of this. Let's go. Well, since we don't have a problem here, Coach Johnson, I don't see why you can't return. Yes! I knew it. Yes, Yeah, so creepy motherfuckers like you don't come up in here and do anything to me. Hey, uh, I, I know I messed up. I owe you an apology. Yeah, you do. I broke up on him. Well, I'm supposed to trust you. I don't respect none of that shit, dog. No. You gonna do that shit again, just as sure as you gotta be. Nah, uh, nah. Uh, remember that situation you was having with that nigga Ray? Mm -hmm. I had it before. What the fuck that is? Hey, if it ever happened again, you could just turn this into the police. Bro, he's my brother. He's supposed to be my brother. Don't ever do that shit no more, dog. Mm -hmm. oh, you ain't got to worry about jail. You got to worry about me busting the cap in your ass. I can respect him. Yeah. Well, I'm That's all I'm never on. What you about to get into? Oh, no. What you got planned? Then you go see me, tour, slide. You want to roll? Shit. As long as you ain't going to no gay club. Why did it bring you in? All right, now, girls, listen. When I'm gone, don't y'all open that door for nobody. You understand? Yes, ma'am. Okay, now all y'all got to do is just make sure you finish your homework and then shower up. You got it? Yeah, yeah. Okay. Hey. It's good, beautiful. Hey, good to see you. You ready? Yeah, I'm ready. Yeah. All right, girls, we're about to head out. Remember what I said, okay? Yeah. All right. Yeah. You want to go? Girl, I'm so glad you got through that. I am too. I just finna work trying to get it behind me now. Right. So, 
Do I see a picture for y'all too? Oh, no. What even happened to your boyfriend anyways? Right. You know, that's a good question. Right after that big fight that we had, he just never came back to the house, which is fine with me. That's love. Man, I think your auntie and Coach Lyric gonna hook up. I don't know. They might. I know one thing for sure, though. What? Hey, y'all want some more shots? Yeah. Dang, who that is knocking at the door like that? I don't know. Where you going? Your auntie said don't open up the door for nobody. How you doing? I'm Detective Boston with the missing person unit. Is Victoria Wilson here? No, she's not home. You mind if I step in? You think we get on the phone? It's rather urgent. Hello. Hello? Okay. Don't say shit. I'm on the way. Okay. Everything all right? Hey, Mike, see, I'll get what you need, all right? Well, well, well. Ms. Wilson, I was here for you, but the person I'm looking for right here, Ms. Lyric Johnson. You know, you're a hard person to catch up with. What's all this even about? Ray Hernandez is missing. And your little girlfriend here, I'm wonderful questioning. Would you like to go downtown with me? That's unnecessary. She ain't got nothing to do with none of that. You ain't got to explain that to him. Um, I'll go, because I really ain't got nothing to hide. All right. Hey, man, ease up. I'll be right down there. All right. Ms. Johnson, I'm Detective Austin, and I believe you know why we're here. I think you know something that can help with this case. I'm sorry, but I don't know nothing. Don't bullshit me. I'm not finna say something you wanna hear. I don't know nothing dealing with this case. You wanna make a heart? Detective, Detective Boston, am I being charged with anything at this moment? Sure do. Well, I guess I'm free to leave then. Miss Johnson, I know you think it's the last time you see me, but we'll meet again. <laughs> 